Wait, extra tank from where? Establishment? What's that? I'm gonna guess this this movie just ends with everyone killing each other. Hmm. But I don't think the movie's that creative enough to go with it. And the eagle's gonna come take this guy too. How much you love that? Stop giving the movie ideas! <laughs> I'm sorry, I get no irony when I see it. Yeah, irony defines this entire movie. Wow, that was a bad death scene. That guy's clearly pining for an Oscar. <sighs> He'll get a Razzie. You know, it kind of reminds me when I used to watch Wild and Crazy Kids, and they'd have Wait, no, 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 no. Dude, there's a can of gas. You and, and the gun. Get, go, get, get, get the gas. Get the gas. No, don't leave. Get the... Get the Sorry, he's leaving. Get the, get, the, get the gas can. You left behind the... Get, go! Go back. Get the gas can. Oh, no. Find your ass's grass. Oh. <gasps> that guy's death scene kind of reminded me of watching Wild and Crazy Kids when I was a kid. And they would have the adults like spray ketchup and mustard balls at each other till the other one would collapse into the pool. <laughs> Remember there was one woman who like ran around it a few times like, Oh, oh, I'm coming! And she splashed into it. That's just what this guy reminded me of. Fair enough. Whoa, whoa. Either this... There's creek over there. We can get some fresh water. Are you, just... Are you done with all your water already? They got like 40 things of water. And haven't you had any food since those sandwiches at the picnic tables? Yeah, but according to this movie's timeline, that must have been at least a month ago. And look, they're gonna go back outside and eat. Are you telling me you're gonna go into the woods? Where there's... Lots of... BIRDS! Um, well, we haven't seen any birds trees. here yet. Maybe. And have you noticed it's just eagles and hawks so far? And buzzards. I saw a couple buzzards. Or vultures, or whatever they're supposed to be. I know the CGI is so bad that there's no distinction of species. Clearly, this person did not care any a bit about ornithology. So we went from a rom com of a guy who's a technician and salesman, and a girl who wants to be a model, and then it just turned into ah, birds are attacking. No, this would the. This would have been a rom com if there was actually. Who's that guy now? Uh. Who's that? Who's that? Come on, or shoot! Don't shoot! Peace, man! Come down here! Oh, God. Yeah, How much... This guy has a face you can trust. Oh, how much longer do we have? 17 minutes. We're almost through. He has long hair, so he must be Native American. So he must know how to stop the birds. How? He must have been. We only have 17 more minutes of this, guys. Why are you hiding in the trees? Well, this is my home. I live here. That's my house. You live in a tree... Oh, tree house. Tree house. Tree house. You live in a tree? No. I sure do. So... You're a tree hunter? Ah, <laughs> uh, you can put it that way. I love trees. They're my family. I look out for them and protect these precious redwoods. It looks like a Ray Romano wannabe. Yeah. Sure. Yes, that'll be fine. No way, it's too dangerous. The eagles might come there. <laughs> oh, they won't. You're very safe here in the forest. Haven't you noticed those eagles seem to be going after people in their cars and gas stations? Besides, it's not the eagle that I worry about. It's the dry, drought weather that's killing these trees. Oh, not enough rain no. or water. No, not an environmental message. This is an environmental movie. Green to red. I remember when those beetles used to die out during the winter. But now with the dry climate, they've multiplied and taken over the forest. You take a look at that dead redwood up there. I was killed by a bark beetle. I see those bark beetles. We must have their revenge on them after the eagles. Damn global warming. Oh. Oh. This makes Fern Goalie look like an Oscar winning animation compared to this. Bad campers who start forest wildfires, but it's impossible for me 
You know who's the bad guy in this movie? Could it be Man? Tom. Oh, okay. now they get to names. How are you gonna do that against the four star dude? In a few years, they'll be gone. Just like the Mountain Lion. I gotta get back to my house. You gotta get your car. It's very nice meeting you. Oh no, sorry, that's my stomach growling. Wow, uh, wow. That was <coughs> that was clearly you, Tap G. This movie does not have that kind of creative license. No kid, right? Okay, so after that, um, shameful finger waving at global warming because man is bad and trees are good. How much further, like, oh. I haven't seen that kind of preachy trees are good oh, message oh, since the Oh, the lighting Lorax. hurts my eyes. I haven't seen that kind of preachy tree hugging since the Lorax. Goodness. Did they really just get lost in the woods? I farted, sorry. <laughs> Deus Ex Machina! Oh no! Oh no! It's CGI fire! I think I hear a mountain lion. Did the mountain lion start the fire? And this is where Smokey the Bear comes up and says, Only you can protect against forest fires! Actually, I was waiting for a meerkat to come out with the mountain lion. It'd be Timon and Puma. Ah, 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 ah. Wow. Oh, and the fire just suddenly disappeared. In the trans. <laughs> the pixels of the smoke were too big! Cough, cough! Oh, they found their way back to the van. Thank goodness? Oh, come on. It's a B movie cliche. The car won't start! Oh, no, their car has managed to. Oh. Look, the fire's back. Oh no. That forest looks way too green to be burning. Oh. Imagine there's no birds. I'm only glad that, you know, we're not seeing that blue Mustang anymore, but... More driving! Well... No, what lighthouse? Wait, my? My? The girl from the... What? What? How? What? what? She <laughs> lives all the way... No, 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 no. Hold on. Oh. She has to drive that far just to go on their date? It's been implied that they've driven like hundreds of... Like a hundred miles or so away from where they've been living. And I say implied because I have no actual clue. You've been awfully quiet there, Tower Girl. Yeah. I'm sleepy because of this movie. I don't blame you. Oh, imagine peace has been dead. Clyde, Clyde, are you okay? Clyde. No, you you look kind. Of, oh, 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 she's alive. Yes. Not like we we're worrying about you or anything. You know. Clyde. Clyde. Now she's dead. She was Clyde. hanging on so her best friend could nudge her and see her Clyde. imagine peace shirt. Dot com. Uh, yeah, okay, now 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 we know she's dead. Yep, and fade out to fade into more driving. Like I said, guys, we only have about ten minutes of this left. I mean, what more can we possibly see in these ten minutes? There is no... Damn it, ran out of gas. Uh, Maybe you should have got the gas can! Oh! Lucky, someone might drive by. Yeah, so you can hold them up? Like Senior Cowboy did a little while ago? So let's, uh, <laughs> let's look around a little bit and see if somebody will try. Oh. I'm hungry. Well, maybe you should have something to eat at the last gas station. I don't know. I guess we're going to start out here. That would be a better fate for them than to have to be in. Let's start walking. How about that? Because only birds go after cars, apparently. This oh. is true. Well, by the movie's hey, logic. Look, a fishing rod. I can go catch some fish. Uh, Careful, or you'll catch an osprey. 
can cook it. Oh, look, we can cook it. Hey, good idea. Uh, what? Uh, they, they just happen to have a fishing rod and a stove. I don't even know if they're allowed to fish there. Yeah, it doesn't look like... It looks like there's a no fishing sign on that sign. <laughs> I don't think there would be any fish biting in that kind of churning waves anyway. Seriously. I mean, I'm no fisherman. Oh, and where are they going to get bait? Oh, look, a fishing pole. We can catch fish. With what bait? They had a stove and a fishing pole. Wait, where did the stove go? I don't know, is it that Tupperware container she's carrying? Like seaweed? What, what are they hoping to catch with seaweed? A parrotfish? You get to eat seaweed. <laughs> That's the most pointless bit of dialogue I've seen in this movie yet. And there's been a lot. Dude, again, fish don't go swimming around looking for things to eat in churning water. <sighs> <laughs> oh, how long must they walk toward the water? And oh, oh, come on, we're walking to the water. Why don't we get a little closer and actually be able to see them getting seaweed? No, no. Let's just. Let's I need. I need a. I need a magnifying glass to see. Oh, and look at this! Look at this beautiful shot. Oh, this looks like he's taking a pee. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, we're playing catch with a ball. And I've got a big gash on my hand. This doesn't hurt. These kids look so horrendously bored. Oh, look at that nice fish. It's a plastic prop from the studio next door. I got some seaweed. Awkward pose. Good. I'm gonna go to the van and get the stove so we can cook this. Why didn't you bring the stove with you? Do these people forget that their friends are dead, that they've left everything behind, and that they're out of gas, they have nowhere to go, and that birds are attacking? Well, birds were attacking. We haven't seen a bird in over, like, five minutes. What happened to all of them? They just decided, eh, we're not going to kill anybody anymore? Well, they're not by their car. They're not at a gas station. This is the slowest, most awkward cooking of fish I have ever seen. They didn't gut it? They didn't... They didn't scale it? Where'd they get the plates? Product placement. God, these kids are whiners. I want to start to death. Look at that frown. That is an Emmy Award winning frown. Oh no, oh, the birds are back! Good! I want them to be happy ending to this. I want those kids to shut up and stop whining. I want all this to just end. I think they just want the fish. Oh no, we suddenly ran two miles in like... We gotta get into the car of the things that the birds are pur purposely attacking. Oh, here, take the gun, you idiot! <laughs> What's he firing at? <laughs> you can clearly see he's not aiming anywhere near them. Oh no! Oh! Oh! Uh, uh. That looks like a paintball gun. I wouldn't be surprised if it was. And now he's out of bullets. Well, it, it only took him like 300 shots to run out of bullets. Wait, is that... That's the gas can that they left behind! Oh. 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 Are they just lying in wait for the birds to come into the car? <laughs> yes, they are. Oh. I, I think I need to turn the volume down again. Oh. Wait. That bird just kamikaze ran to the windshield. 
Oh, it's supposed to blow up. 